Hello and welcome back to your first yoga class. Okay, so we've been through a lot of different sections and now we are getting so close uh, to the end. Next, we wanna look at our lower back strengthening. Um, I just wanna say real quick, thank you for being here. If you have not already hit the subscribe button or given this video a like, um, please, I appreciate it so much. But let's go ahead and lay on our stomachs and do some of our uh, low back strengthening. So, um, this is probably, you know, um, not, again, these terms are very loose, right? Um, I'm not sure if you can go uh, look up in a dictionary and find low back strengthening series for yoga and it's going to have an exact set of postures and you know um, those things uh, it's just the fact that um, these poses really do target the low back and um, this is more of a strengthening for the low back and it's not so much of a loosening and you know uh, relaxing portion so um, laying on the mat a good um, pose is cobra So bring your fingertips up here next to your pecs, roll your shoulders back, bring your feet together, but if they come apart a little bit, that's fine. Um, they'll naturally actually separate just a little bit, which is, which is okay. And roll your shoulders back, and then you want to raise on up just before your pubic bone leaves the ground. So you still want your pubic bone to make contact with the mat. And actually, you want to engage your glutes so you're creating a little bit of downward pressure on that pubic bone. And you take the weight of your torso into your arms. Hands down and back, or elbows down and back, hands by your side. And then lift on up. and raise on down. So that is our cobra. You'll also see another posture called baby cobra, where you bring your palms off of the mat. So you're actually only lifting up about this much, and the more you breathe, the higher you can lift up. And relax on down. So that's a uh, cobra and baby cobra. Um, and then let's look at um, uh, full locus. So um, you bring your hands out like this. And it's kind of also called Superman pose because you fly. So you relax everything down, exhale all of your air, and then inhale, come on up. Superman pose. And maybe if you're flying and you need to dodge a cloud or two, that's cool, but just keep breathing, keep lifting on up. And release, on down. Go ahead and prop yourself up just a little bit. And so in these low back uh, strengthening poses, you can build up a lot of tension in that low back. So sometimes it's good to come into a child's pose to alleviate some of that tension. And one final posture we'll do is floor bow. Bend your knees, grab back for your ankles. And if you can't grab back for your ankles, you can use a strap, uh, a towel, you know, kind of whatever you have available to help you out. Roll your shoulders back and gently kick into those legs. Stay right here and then you really kick and raise on up into your floor bow. Uh, 
Come on down. Release and push it back into your child's pose. Very good. So that's our lower back. And um, again, wow, just thank you for being here and coming along uh, this journey with me. So let's go ahead and check out the next video. We are so close. Pre-Shavasana series, and then after that, Shavasana, and then our class. So we're, we're making great headway. Thanks for being here, and I will see you in the next video. Thank mm -hmm. you.